Now, I want to talk about the how do we tame the high-rise monster? Because this is a problem, and I'm, to, I'm talking about this particularly to, in, in, in current situation when everybody is worried about higher density and our environment will, will get uh, 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 poorly affected. But let's see, if we plan with methods intelligently, we can actually uh, pro provide wonder. So, the vertical line is the amount of effort you have to put in, okay? So the green area is a government part. The black area, which I think is the right choice of color, is for people. So anyway, the government must have vision, strategies, and uh, preserve history and nature, protect history and nature, master plan, detailed plan, and so on and so forth. I want to highlight today that when we do master planning, at the same time, this is the word that I've never seen anyone else use, is to look at macro environmental design. Design the environment on a macro scale, which we did. And also, when we do the new town, we must look at the micro environment design. In other words, it's not urban design, it's just shaping the whole area. Okay. And then urban design, this, this you are familiar with. I want to introduce a concept, macro-environment design, micro-environment design, which was used. And uh, the government must take the lion's share at the beginning, and, but leave the rest of the people. Now, a lot of people say this is undemocratic. Well, in fact, I was talking to some Americans last night. And they were so envious that our government could do this because in their government, because of democracy, the government cannot take on such a big role. And then the future of the city is very uncertain. So while we get criticized by American type Democrats, but I think we must, must be aware that this is the reason for Singapore to be the way it is today. The government involvement is very heavy. Because in my mind, the government's job is to create a perfect stage and the people is to act out exciting drama on the stage. So we should give the people lots of freedom, but the government must also shoulder its responsibility.